In that video, we are going to discover how to create a simple counter application for Android. It is the ideal tutorial for beginners. First, you need to create the user interface of the application. We will have a text view to display counter value. We define text size and margin top value. We center horizontally the text view in the parent layout. Then we need to define the controls of our game. Three buttons, minus, reset, and plus. Nested in a linear layout. And we add the plus button. And don't forget to center horizontally the controls layout. We can preview the display of our user interface in the design view for the current layout. We add some margin between the reset button and the minus and plus buttons. OK, it looks great. Next step is to write the Java code of the main activity. We define properties for the counter text view and the three buttons. Then we define the onClickListener instance which will be used to manage clicks of the user on the buttons. We get references of the views in the onCreate method and we install ClickListener on them.
it's time for the logical part of our application with the init counter method and the methods to increment and decrement counter. In the init counter method, we need the counter to zero and we set the text to the counter text view. The init counter is called in the onCreate method. We create the plus counter method to increment the counter by one and we don't forget to update the value of the counter in the counter text view by calling the set text method. Now we can write the code for the onClick listener instance. We call the good method according to the button clicked. For the minus button, we call the decrement counter method called minus counter plus counter for the plus button. And for the reset button, we have just to init counter the second time. It's done for the code. We can try our counter application by clicking on the run button on Android Studio. We wait during the gravel build. We wait, we wait. The APK will be installed in some seconds. Okay, there is a little bug, so we need to open Android Monitor to find the bug. We open the Android Monitor view. Okay, so there is a problem with the set text call because the counter is an integer, so we need to convert it to a string to avoid a resource not found exception. And now we can retry the application. Okay, so we can click on the buttons to play with the counter. We increment, we can decrement the counter, or we can reset the counter if you want. So that's all for that tutorial. To discover more tutorials on Android development, don't hesitate to subscribe to the SRL channel.